Yeah, yeah, you're good. You're good. Okay. So we've got Cyber All versus oh. <laughs> versus Saba. I never know what I'm in for when I see an Olimar. Uh, you're in for some some nice camping. Uh, but Cyber, well, Olimar also got some pretty nice buffs in the most recent patch, 7.0.0. Did he? Did he? What did he get? What did he get? Yeah, so previously, right, there was a lot of issues with Olimar's shield. Uh, and it just it just didn't work, or rather, the shield did not fully cover his body, which meant that Olimar had a lot of trouble dealing Wait, with shield the only pressure. One? They did that to everybody, didn't they? Well, okay, so they didn't buff him specifically for it, I guess. Uh, but a lot of characters actually had similar like shield issues. Like Kirby, I think, is another one where his shield just didn't really cover him completely. Um, and so what it means is that you really couldn't deal with shield pressure that well. Oh, he just went so deep. Yeah. He's... I always feel like Joker's up D will get you like spots you don't quite expect after that maximum's reach. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh! <laughs> Alrighty. Okay. So. No stocks closed out yet. Yep. Let's right now it's a pretty guard. even Ooh, game. Uh, so Cyber's throwing away some of his uh, yellow because he doesn't really need it. So now we're in the camping get... phase. Oh, he zoned him to the corner. Mm -hmm. Edge guard starting. Bears oh, over him. That wasn't safe, but luckily he doesn't get the punish. Spot dodge to, ja to uh, dodge out the F tilt out of shield and able to grab him for the kill. Okay. So Sabo's not down by too much right now. Yeah, but. Not nah, going too hard at all. Two. Save. You can tell. Yes, Cyber just knows he has the lead, and he's not going to approach. <laughs> Constantly with that fadeback game, he's not afraid to just stay on his half of the stage. <laughs> okay. Oh, yes. If there's anything else... Okay. This is where Olimar just becomes so scary, too, because all that zoning potential, all the Pikmin, all the range on his aerials and stuff will just keep you out for days. Plus, he's under that platform, too, so he has to approach low with short hops. Yeah. This is the, so Olimar really struggles with getting out of the corner, but, you know, when he has a lead, that's where he excels, because when Olimar is behind, right, Olimar wants to sort of just throw or run away, throw some Pikmin, uh, condition you to an unsafe option, maybe hit you with an up smash out of shield. Um, but when he's behind, he can't really get that. Luckily, Cyber is doing a pretty good job of keeping the lead this game and doing a good job of catching Sabo's aggressive landing Definitely. with a grab. Okay, setting up for the edge guard now. They just went high. Good way to avoid. Yeah, he had ground, get up, or roll and get up attack pretty much covered there. Mm -hmm. That was an right. F tilt out of shield to try and punish the purple up smash. I'm not really sure if what that would have actually ended up punishing. Uh, a couple times earlier, I think he may have just been turned around the wrong way, or the opposite way of what he expected. I think, um, well, it's it's good sometimes to like throw out a hitbox there, but I'm not sure what option. So maybe if uh, Cyber, if, oh no, low <laughs> short privilege runs right under the Aha and hits him with an F smash. So we've seen him play defensively, but he's not afraid to approach what he needs to as well. Yeah, I and think now now we see it again. He is going to just wall out as hard as he can. Fry for all that extra percent. Okay. Ooh, good approach. Yeah, hey, he's at sixty-four percent. But <laughs> Salo didn't even really lose neutral or anything. He just yeah, kind of got hit cool. by a few Pikmin. Okay. okay he goes low and he goes like low. Cyber expected it and then so just, yeah, sorry was going and then went high. Good counter. All right, he's going for the ratchet. Nah, dude, I'd hate to be Sabo here. <laughs> this is just... How are you gonna get in? Oh, no. Goes for the dash attack, but it's getting punished with an up smash out of shield. Yeah, this is... This is gonna be the make or break point, is just can he approach? Ooh, that was oh, nice. Was great conversion That was a there. falling up there into a rising up there to kill it. Luckily, Olimar is really light, so he's still able to get that. He played so patient for that opportunity to come out, too, and just instantaneously capitalized. That was yeah. really smooth, I saw that. All right, can he get the comeback, though? Oh, he's got Parson. Let's see if he can get out of the corner. Up. Okay, he's the edge guard. Keeps Goes going low, low again. Yeah, he keeps but going low, and Cyber's just... Oh, he's got to get that off of him. Stage. All right, he's got a blue on him. 
He shouldn't go for anything too aggressive unless he's afraid of getting grabbed, or unless he gets grabbed. Up. All right, purple's the next one up. Oh, is he gonna make it? Oh, oh no. A little too deep. That was a great best match, though. Definitely both oh, players not wait. afraid of a timer. <laughs> you can tell. Oh, who was the timer at the end? Oh, it was, uh, he had a couple minutes left, I think, still. But they were they were very patient. Yeah, you, you could tell. Like, nobody was rushing in. You know, mm -hmm. even when he was being camped, he, he just, like, <laughs> you could tell when he did lose his patience and he just, like, going with the dash attack. He I was just, Cyber was just ready oh, with that, that up smash out of shield, mm -hmm. oh, waiting for him to play his game. I think Sabo sort of realized that his aggression was getting a little bit punished, and so like the end, the end portion. This is like something is really useful versus someone who's trying to camp you out. It's like, like, all right, they're not going to approach me. We got some time on the clock. Let me let me just like think for a moment how exactly I'm going to get in. What am I going to do? And it seems like Sabo's response is, I will just camp you. I've got guns. Guns beat carrots. Yeah. Well, but to the platforms, I open up a whole new, you know, level for him to get around the camping. Because, mm -hmm. like, one piece of advice a friend gave me is if you don't have an opening, just camp until they get one. <laughs> you know what I mean? So we'll see if he can, maybe the platform layout was uh, what he really wanted to get around to. Yeah, get around I, to, uh, pick I think uh, what I'd like to see is maybe a little bit more aggressive approaches maybe not with dash ah, attacks it's, like, it's like how <laughs> you know? smash out, smash. every time he tries it just looks like cyber has it covered so it seems like a lot of the times right when sabo approaches cyber's option is a uh he'll maybe go for a grab or he'll shield uh or dash back with a grab or ooh, god i'm trying to get up or b uh he'll, he'll just throw out pikmin waiting for you to come in and so Sabo keeps approaching with either A, an aggressive aerial, like an air or something that gets oh, punished. Oh, juggles. Oh, gosh. Oh, I got so much percentage off that. That was great. Great conversion. Or he's going in with like a dash attack, right? But oh, nice. Cyber can just hold shield and he doesn't really need to fear anything, right? He wants, he needs to fear those grads, but Sabo needs to be a little bit more aggressive going for it. Got rid of the Pikmin for the extra lift. Ah, oh, he still couldn't close out the stock. It's so slippery off stage. Ditch those Pikmin, and I think it, you get like a movement speed buff too with Olimar's Uppy. Yeah, his, his, you are. his aerial speed definitely goes up a little bit in the very beginning when he's using his uh, B. Man, this counter pick is not uh, working out how Sabo wanted. Yeah. I mean, then again, right, Battlefield is a pretty good stage for Olimar as well, just because he likes having all those platforms to sort of cap under. On top of that, it sort of helps his juggling a little bit uh, with up airs. Yep, another aggressive option. Cyber's with, just been punished. Iron defense has not been broken yet. That's going to be the keys. I mean, he hasn't lost yet. You know what I mean? If, <laughs> if he just downloads Cyber hard. Gets it figured out. He's got to get some kind of approach down. Yeah, he starts putting in more tomahawks. I'd say honestly, tomahawk like this, this H? edge guarding isn't really working for him. I'd say give it up. Right. <laughs> uh, just ledge trap. trap. Yeah, because yeah. a lot of the times, right, if you whiff your edge guarding, you're essentially giving up your opportunity to actually ledge trap. And so Olimar's really struggled with getting off the ledge. Oh, oh good oh, tech. You saved it. But uh, Sabo isn't really cap able to capitalize on it. Wing pick and dash into the fair, but right, he's Sabo did first. not punish any of it. Gets the blue up throw. Right. I think that was, ooh, he definitely got, I'm not sure how many times he died to the blue up throw. Well, it was at least two stocks lost his game to the left. Ah, such a strong defensive play. You could tell just like in the neutral and also in disadvantage. Whenever mm -hmm. 